Good morning children. Today we are going to see 6th English Unit 3. Poem I dream of spices. What are spices? Spices is a seed, fruit, root, bark or other plant substance primarily used for flavoring or coloring food. Spices play a significant role in the way we cook and consume food around the world. Every spices has its own flavoring and essence. Children, this poem was written by Raj Arumugam. Now, let's start the poem. This poem has 16 lines. This is a simple and interesting poem by Raj Arumugam. And this poem is about a little boy's memory while shopping for his mother. Now, let's see the poem. My mother would say, little boy Raj, go to Muthus and get some cinnamon, bitchel leaves and ginger and garlic. And so I go to the shops singing all the way. And when Muthu asks me what I would want, I rattle off a list. Sesame seeds, onions, tomatoes and pickles. And back home, mother fist my ears. Ouch! Now, let's see the explanation for this poem. My mother would say, little boy, Raj, go to Muthus and get some cinnamon, bitter leaves and ginger and garlic. Let's see the explanation for this stanza. This is Raj. This is Raj's mother. This is Muthu's shop. Raj lives with his mother in a small house. One day, Raj's mother asked him to go to Muthu's shop to buy some Cinnamon, cinnamon is nothing but the bark of a tree that gives a delicious flavor to food. Bitchel leaves, this is bitchel wine. The bitchel vine is an evergreen perennial with glossy hot shaped leaves. Health benefits of bitchel leaves. It is good for diabetes. It helps to cure asthma, depression and to reduce cholesterol. Ginger. Ginger is one of the oldest medicinal foods. It is widely used spice which gives a delicious flavor to 
ఫుడ్ గార్లిక్ గార్లిక్ ఇస్ నథింగ్ బట్ ఎ స్మాల్ బల్బ్ విత్ ఎ స్ట్రాంగ్ టేస్ట్ ఇట్ ఇస్ యూస్డ్ ఇన్ కుకింగ్ అండ్ సో ఐ గో టు ద షాప్స్ సింగింగ్ ఆల్ ద వే అండ్ వెన్ ముత్తు ఆస్క్ మీ వాట్ ఐ వుడ్ వాంట్ ఐ రెటల్ ఆఫ్ ఎ లిస్ట్ ససమి సీడ్స్ ఆనియన్స్ టొమాటోస్ అండ్ పికల్స్ లెట్ సీ ద ఎక్స్ప్లెనేషన్ ఫార్ దిస్ ట్రాన్సా నౌ రాజ్ గోస్ టు ముత్తూస్ షాప్ ఆన్ ఇస్ వే టు ముత్తూస్ షాప్ he is singing all the way the things what his mother asked him to buy raj reached muttu's shop muttu asked what do you want raj recited the things recited means to repeat the words of as from memory recited means to repeat the words of as from memory raj bought sesame seed this is sesame plant sesame seeds are tiny flat oval seeds sesame seeds are the oldest known oil seeds and have the highest content of oil than any other variety of nuts and come in a variety of colors white black yellow and red natural sesame seeds are largely served in bakery products such breads breadsticks cookies candies pasta vegetables and curry dishes the roasted variety of natural sesame seeds are used in chocolate ice cream and alva onions this is onion plant onions are bulb shaped vegetables that grow underground also known as bulb onions or common onions they are grown worldwide commonly used as a flavoring or side dish tomatoes this is tomato plant the tomato is consumed in different ways raw or cooked in many dishes sauce salad and drinks pickles pickle is nothing but pickle is the process of preserving or extending the shelf life of food is called pickle and back home mother with my ears ouch let's see the explanation for the stanza when raj came back to his home his mother twisted his ears raj cried out of pain 
children why rod's mother twisted his ear can you guess because raj bought sesame seeds onions tomatoes and pickles instead of buying cinnamon bitter leaves ginger and garlic now we came to an end of the poem let's see the glossary for this poem first one cinnamon the bark of the tree that gives a delicious flavor to food second one garlic a small bulb with a strong taste used in cooking third one rattle off recite fourth one sesame seeds gingerly seeds fifth one ouch sound that expression pain children now i will give you some important points from this poem so maintain a separate notebook for english in case of any doubt make a note of it which will be clarified on the day of reopening first one this is a simple and interesting poem by raj armugam second one this poem is about a little boy's memory while shopping for his mother third one raj lives with his mother in a small house fourth one one day raj's mother asked him to go to the muttu's shop to buy some cinnamon bitter leaves ginger and garlic fifth one raj goes to muttu shop on his way to muttu's shop he is singing all the way the things what his mother asked to buy sixth one raj reached muttu's shop muttu asked raj what do you want seventh one raj recited the things eighth one when raj came back to his home his mother with his ears raj cried out of pain ninth one because raj bought sesame seeds onions tomatoes and pickles instead of buying cinnamon bitter leaves ginger and garlic now let's see the alliteration alliteration is here stressed syllables with the same sound or sound group repeating at the beginning of two or more words examples strong straight yes is the alliteration tree three t is the alliteration on second you can go through the poem and answer for those evaluation choose the correct answers first one mother called dash option a muttu option b raj option c ram second one mother did not ask for dash option a cinnamon option b cardamom option c bitter leaves third one raj did not buy dash option a onions and sesame option b ginger and garlic option c tomato and pickles find the alliteration from the poem lines
answer the following questions first one who is raj second one where did raj's mother send him third one who is muttu fourth one what did mother ask raj to buy fifth one what did raj buy